Well, this week marks one year until the 2020 presidential election, and Arizona is one of just three or four states that could decide who wins the White House. Yesterday's elections in Kentucky, Virginia, and here in Arizona show voters are fired up and engaged. Team 12 political insider Bram Resnick is here with three trends to watch in 2020. Bram? And we're setting the table for the long and probably bitter campaign to come. Arizona polling shows the races for president and our U.S. Senate seat are a toss up. Here are three trends that tell us about the Arizona voters who will help decide those elections. A long line of ASU students snaking into the night. We actually have a voice now. They were fired up to vote in the 2018 midterm elections, and that could be a preview of 2020. We actually have the power to to uh, put into motion what we want to put into motion as a as a generation. The rate of Arizona State University students registering to vote and then casting a ballot doubled last year from 2014. The challenge really comes down to is though they are participating more, they are still a pretty small portion of the electorate. The 2020 stakes are high. Our battleground state could decide who wins the White House and which party controls the U.S. Senate. Here are three trends to watch. Since 2010, voters have been getting younger. The share of voters 50 and older has dropped by 10 points to 60% of the electorate. The share of voters 39 and under has bumped up by 8 points to 23% and voters 29 and under now account for more than one in 10 voters. Then that bodes well because they vote about, in some cases, 70 to 75 percent for Democrats, and even higher in some cases. Another trend, the pool of voters is ballooning. Arizona's economic boom translates into a record 3.8 million registered voters, up 21 percent from 2010. Well, there's a lot of folks moving in from out of town. Uh, Maricopa County is the fastest growing county in the entire country. Buckeye is the fastest growing city in the country. Our third trend to watch, Latino voters are gaining a lot more clout. Over the last decade, the Latino share of Arizonans who cast a ballot has almost doubled from 11% to a projected 19.5% next year. You can't look at them as a, just a giant group and speak to them with one message. And Arizona saw a huge turnout in the 2018 midterm elections. We could, we could see record voter turnout of 80% next year. Back over to you.